Big news coming in from the state of Kerala where there are constant election campaigning and rallies that are happening. V. Murli Dharan, who is also uh, the MOS External Affairs Minister, has uh, put out a video and the BJP is also alleging that while V. Murli Dharan was campaigning in Atengal constituency, certain anti-social elements tried to provoke and disrupt the campaign. And uh, the video shows three people in a bike honking non-stop, saying, give side and then overtake the campaign vehicle. Now, this is being seen as a, deliberately, uh, pro a deliberate provocation against the leader that he knew it was the BJP leader's campaign rally that's happening and that this was to intimidate him. Now, V. Murlidharan has also shared the video and has said, I will not be intimidated by the goons of CPM Kerala. And that's where I bring in Shibimol for the latest on that uh, to, to tell us what's been happening. Now, Shibimol, it's one thing to say that there are some anti-social elements, something is growing, and then to V. Murlidharan to put it out on social media and claim these were CPM Kerala carders trying to intimidate me. Has any action been taken? How are the cops looking at it? Tell us the details in this case. Uh, well, uh, the BJP leader, the BJP put out this video saying that, uh, you know, some anti-social elements try to disrupt the, disrupt this campaign. When we spoke to, uh, you know, the BJP leaders, they said that around at three locations, these three same people were found. They were trying to, you know, disrupt the campaign. And that's when they called up the police and later the campaign was continued after, you know, uh, along with the police. So, uh, but yeah, yes, uh, the CPM connection is what uh, the uh, BJP leaders are alleging. They're saying that, uh, this uh, all the all three of them are CPIM workers. Remember, Arting is a constituency where the CPIM has a very strong influence. So, if the CPIM workers trying to disrupt my campaign and I would not be intimidated, is what uh, 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 External Affairs Minister uh, MOS uh, External Affairs as well as uh, uh, the Article NDA candidate Veen Murli is saying. As for police, uh, they have taken one person into custody. They are saying that uh, as the preliminary analysis, it did not look mm -hmm. like a, a planned, uh, you know, a planned action okay uh, it looks like they were actually drunk or they actually were asking for side and uh, you know uh, that's what the preliminary analysis what the police is saying they've taken one person because they're investigating further details uh, they're saying so, that uh, uh, as of now they've not found any party connection but they will definitely investigate further so and it's, a, it's a developing story so was it just a coincidence that there were three men who were trying to disrupt him and trying to take a side and then overtake and go ahead? Or was this a deliberate political intimidation as V. Dharan and as the Bharatiya Janata Party are claiming? But remember, it is only reflective of uh, the situation and developments on the ground as well, even in the state of Kerala, where the CPM Kada or the CPM is currently the ruling party. I appreciate you joining us, Shibimol, for the latest on what's brewing in the southern state of Kerala.